Now, uh, this is an important point and one that I think uh, th that you're going to want to respond to. Uh, a lot of the folks that I talk to for this story, when I ask them, you know, why do you think that uh, members of uh, Cong or members of the Senate don't want to include uh, single payer as part of the discussion this time around, uh, they all say the same thing, which is follow the money. Now, uh, on just yesterday at a town hall meeting in Rio Rancho, New Mex Mexico, a woman in the audience asked President Obama, and I quote. Why is Senator Baucus on the Finance Committee discussing health care when he has received so much money from the pharmaceutical companies? Isn't it a conflict of interest? Now, there's groups out there like Consumer Watchdog and another, a number of others that say, you've see, received more campaign contributions as a Democrat um, from the pharmaceutical and health insurance industries than any other current Democratic member of the House or Senate. So what do you tell people who say that the reason single payer isn't up for discussion is because the chairman of the Senate Finance Committee has an interest in protecting the people who stand to lose the most if this discussion were to take place, the private, for-profit insurance and pharmaceutical companies who contribute so much money to his campaign. Money means nothing to me. I pay no attention to campaign contributions. Nothing. 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 It makes no difference. And if you look at what I've done to the and actions I have taken against um, pharmaceuticals, against the health insurance industry, against those, you, uh, uh, some of those, uh, those organizations you've named, you'll see that the record bears it out. Uh, money means nothing. It's neutral. I call them as I see them. As I call the uh, decisions with respect to public policy on any subject, I don't care what it is, as I see it. And um, it's, that's the case now. It's always been the case. Uh, I pay no attention to campaign contributions. Zero. It has no effect on me. All right, Senator. We really should wrap this up. Uh, one more question. You said more. if you look at if you look at the uh, the actions that you've taken against the pharmaceutical and healthcare industries, can you give me some examples? Um, yeah, it's first on rebates. They don't like us. So I'm talking about the pharmaceuticals now. Uh, we passed laws that they have, they have to pay more. That's on rebates. Um, the um, They're going to have to phone him up. They're going to have to, and I'm increasing the rebates, the Medicaid rebates under health care reform, increasing. They don't like that at all. Um, it's get technical, but I can tell you, they don't like it. And uh, another is um, that there's going to have to be some, or probably some, um, it's called a rebate for Medicare Advantage funds. They're very much opposed to that. Um, in addition, I favor generic drugs and laws favoring generic drugs. Not brand name drugs, generic. They don't like that. I mean, it's um, the public option plan. It's on the table. They hate it. And I tell them that's strongly being considered. And that's just a few examples with respect to only one industry. I could go down a long list for every other industry, too. So uh, you say to those critics, there's no merit to that argument. All right. You, you say to the critics, you say that you've received right, a lot of money. You say no Zero. merit to that. None. Zero. Money, I mean, money means nothing. I, don't, I pay no attention to contributors are. None. Nothing. Got to run now. Thanks, John. All right. Thank you. Bye.